how they benched him. They're probably looking to sell him for money so that they can get some some of that investment investment back. And they don't have the money to to buy somebody who's at least on par with that kind of star power, right? And Fnatic obviously are doing the same thing. They're not they they got Afro, who was a free agent, who's probably not gonna be costing a lot in terms of salary. And they got Dexter, who's probably similar thing, you know, is not gonna be super high buyout buyout. Mao's already wanted him out. So I don't even know if his contract ran out or what happened exactly there, but probably a very cheap addition as well, you know? So mm -hmm. even though you're a partner team, that's basically the only thing that's going for you. You know, you don't have the other star pieces that people would be attracted to. You don't have the money to get some of these bigger players. You're just in a position where you have to make either kind of subpar upgrades from players that are kind of proven, subpar additions, I would say, maybe not even upgrades, or you have to scout really deep for like really diamonds in the rough, you know, that you can find. I don't think either of them did one of those things, to be honest. Because 